this agri drainage training video we will be discussing surface drainage. Surface drainage entails the use of contour banks, waterways, open drains and 3D landforming to manage surface water and ponding. A common misconception is that 3D landforming is the same as laser leveling. The difference between laser land leveling and 3D landforming is that GPS allows us to not only deal in flat planes but work with curves in our design so that we move as little as possible topsoil and only move what is necessary to prevent ponding and ensure proper surface drainage. When doing a surface drainage design, modern software allows us to do a number of different analysis. These greatly assist in choosing the correct solution. These analyses include a drainage or ponding analysis of the existing topography, a runoff analysis to assist with determining erosion risk, and an irrigation analysis that shows irrigation uniformity. After considering the results of the analysis we've run, we need to decide on a landform design. The software allows us five different designs to choose from. A plane design is similar to laser leveling and is mostly suited to resurfacing old laser design fields. A one-way drainage design allows us to design a field to drain in one way only along the furrows most suited for furrowed fields. Two-way drainage design is also used on furrowed fields but it allows drainage in two directions instead of one. The four-way design is mostly suited for unfurrowed fields and it allows water to drain out of the field in any possible direction. A circle drainage design is specifically for centre pivot fields and allows furrows to be created along the centre pivot tracks and the water to drain out by the centre pivot road. By looking at the runoff analysis that we have done on the existing topography, we can then decide where to optimally place contour banks, waterways or open drains to deal with erosion risks. Because of the lower earthworks when doing 3D landforming, we have moved over to grader blades that is GPS controlled on both sides, which is vastly more versatile than the traditional scraper. When doing landforming, it is very important that fills are compacted properly to prevent sagging of these fills, which could cause bonding again. After fields have been landformed, it is important to take up-to-date soil analysis to ensure that soil chemical properties that has been altered can be corrected. It is also important to correctly work the fields as it has been highly compacted during landforming. During the landform design process, a correct plant direction is determined and this should at all times be adhered to as this greatly influences the drainage of a field. Well-designed waterways should always be seeded with grass to prevent erosion. Contour banks should be built correctly so that they don't wash away and open drains should always be kept clean to prevent clogging. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, please visit our website at www.agridrainage.co.za.